Cell phone use in pregnancy, risks for child. A study published in the Journal of Epidemiology and Community Health shows, exposure to cell phones before birth and afterward may increase a child's risk for developing certain behavioral problems, including hyperactivity, inattention, and problems getting along with others. Lika Kifitz, a professor of epidemiology in the UCLA School of Public Health is the study author. The researchers analyzed data on cell phone use from 28,745 seven-year-olds and their mums who were part of the Danish National Birth Cohort study. Among the mothers who use less than an hour a week, 93% of children had no behavioral issues, 3.3% had borderline behavioral problems, and 3.1% showed signs of behavioral problems including emotional symptoms, conduct problems, hyperactivity, inattention, and relationship problems. Whereas among those who were exposed to cell phones during pregnancy and after birth, 18% of children were with greatest risk for behavioral problems. But according to another study published on September 5, 2017 in the journal BMC Public Health, mobile phone use during pregnancy is unlikely to have any adverse effects on child neurodevelopment. Maternal use of mobile phones during pregnancy is not linked to neurodevelopment in children. Dr. Ilnipa Padipalu is the lead author and Professor Jan Alexander is the senior author, both from the Norwegian Institute of Public Health. This is an observational study, and the findings do not support the hypothesis of adverse effects of radio frequency electromagnetic fields on child's language communication and motor skills due to the use of mobile phone during pregnancy. The researchers analyzed data from 45,389 mother-child pairs from Norwegian population-based pregnancy cohort study called MOBAR. The investigation revealed for the first time that maternal mobile phone use may actually have a positive impact. More specifically, Mobile phone use in pregnancy was associated with lower risk of the child having low language and motor skills at three years of age. This protective effect is more likely to be explained by factors not measured in this study having an impact on the mobile phone use and child's neurodevelopment, rather than the maternal mobile phone use in itself. The researchers found that children born to mobile phone users had a 27% lower risk of having lower sentence complexity. 14% lower risk of incomplete grammar and 31% lower risk of having moderate language delay at age 3, compared to children of mothers who reported no mobile phone use. They also found that children born to mobile phone users had an 18% lower risk of low motor skills at age 3, compared to children born to non-users of mobile phones. The study provides evidence that pregnant women's use of cell phone is not associated with risk of harming neurodevelopment of the fetus. The beneficial effects reported should be interpreted with caution due to the limitations common in observational studies. The findings should at least alleviate any concern mothers have about using their mobile phone while pregnant. Different phones give off different exposures, and even those who were reported to be not exposed, probably had significant environmental exposure, rendering the study only slightly more than amusing. It is better, pregnant women should be careful about exposure to radio frequency electromagnetic fields for many reasons. Warnings appear on phones, say pregnant women should avoid exposure to their abdomen. Thank you.